Hey, it's Boy. Welcome back once again to the Nomad Adventure. So, in the last episode, uh, we survived another night of uh, everything. And I think in this episode, because we don't have a lot of stuff really left to do, I'm going to go get everything ready and start leaving my village that I have found. Because even though I would love to be able to stay here and fortify it up and have uh, villagers and everything, I don't have the luxury of doing so. I also need to gather as many resources as I can and then figure out what I'm going to leave. Because even though I have like four days to do stuff in a village, I think it is time for me to move on from this village. I just do not remember if there was another bit of farmland up here or not. I do not believe there is. So, what do I need to do? I want to build or make my potatoes. I have 23 baked potatoes. I want to keep probably two uncooked. So, I'm going to cook those ones. I have 39 extra carrots that I don't, or I can't take with me, unfortunately, and a bunch of dirt, which I'm just going to line this house with. I have bread. I have a saddle I kind of want to keep, so I don't, uh, in case I run into a horse, I can tame it. So, more bread. Um, let me throw things into my pit. So wheat, it's going to go down there. Uh, seeds, don't need a, uh, extra stack. If I have one stack, that's fine. Actually, in fact, I'm going to just toss out half of it. I don't need the books. Arrows would be nice to keep. Uh, food. I will keep the carrots until I am ready, completely ready to leave. Uh, that way... I can just toss them out as need be. Um, so I have coal. I don't... I want to keep the wind sword, but I really don't need it. So I'm going to toss the wind sword. Uh, keep the sugar cane for right now. Toss the stick. Keep the bone. Um, so... Mm, toss the carrots now. I don't really need them that badly. Uh, put some of my better food into my hot bar that I may, well, that I will get rid of quicker, uh, sooner than later. Um, let me go harvest some more planks and some more uh, cobble because those are two things that I would probably need. Um, okay, so here we go. Planks, cobble. So I can have, what, I've... 58 now, so I can get six more. One, two, three, four, five, and six. There we go. And I'm I'm actually going to just call that good for right now and take off before it becomes extremely, extremely dark. Luckily, with the fact I have a bunch of food, I can I can afford to sprint for now. So hopefully I will get far enough away that I will not get killed. Also, there's another bunny rabbit. Bunny rabbit, where are you going? I want to murder you for your... Oh, there's a Skellerman. Why are you not firing at me, Skellerman? That does not make any sense. There's another bunny rabbit. A few bunny rabbits. But... Unfortunately for you, I want your hides so I can potentially make some leather out of them. Oh, I can't remember if it's four. Okay, so it's four four bunnies to one leather. Not, I mean, not the best conversion, but it does allow me to have another... Uh, Another way to get leather without having cows right now. Fortunately, I'm not getting... I'm not getting bunny leather. 
bunny hides. There are quite a few of them here, though, is the nice thing. Come back here. I'm going to just punch you until you are dead, um, and then switch over to my iron sword. There we go. And there we go. One more bunny hide. What is that? Five? That is... I mean, unless you have a farm of rabbits, that is so inconvenient to uh, try and get leather out of them. But, uh, you know, I will I will do what I must do because they also give me food. That is another nice thing about them is they give me food. That's a lot of Skellermans. Run away from the Skellermans. <laughs> Run away from them. They'll give me bones. Which are a very, very nice, helpful item of food. Also, oh, so many pigs. So many pigus. I'm risking it. Um, I heard a spider as well. Um, spider isn't exactly what I want to run into. Aha! I knew you were coming. But, uh, pigus. Also, I think, if I remember right, the uh, grass I'm cutting down is also using a good durability on my sword. Oh, my inventory is filling up something fierce right now. Okay. Kill the pigs. Kill the pigs. I kind of wish, like, more... Like, I can, I can understand, like, sheep only giving you wool, but I'm surprised pigs don't give you some sort of leather as well. So you can make, like, two two pig hides into leather or something of that nature. Um, also, there's a creeper coming up from behind me that I know about. Then I don't really want to stick around severely to let it catch up to me. And there's another. Oh, sheepies! Sheepy, sheepy, sheepies! Finally! If only I had more iron to make shears out of. Um... So sheep, very nice. The only problem with sheep is they do drop wool, but they will drop different colored wool, which is a pain, especially, oh boy, not what I want. Um, yeah, not what I want. I don't want, I don't want the, uh, the witch. Oh, you are so inconvenient. All I want... All I want right now is the sheep. You run away from them all. Uh, hopefully get sheep wool. I need a lot of wool is the, the problem. Because I can... Luckily, I can easily... Um, oh, that is a friggin' lot of sheep, which is what I need. Strafe! Strafe! Spiders! Skelmans! Strafe. Strafe around. I am doing badly. Run away. Run away. Run away. Oh, spider field. Not what I want. Oh, boy. This is like the perfect place, too. Is this like... Oh, hey. Another village. <laughs> I can... Oh, that, that's perfect. I can get another four-day uh, four area to sleep, to rest in. Cause that way I can I can come back over here, collect more sheep, more more sheepies. That's a lot, a lot of sheep. And that's a big village too. That's a freaking big village. That is amazing to run across. Cause possibly one of the I don't want to get too close. I don't want uh I don't want zombies and stuff getting in there. And technically I'm still on the move. Technicalities. Um, yeah, so technically I'm still on the move, so I'm not going to worry too much about, uh, getting too close or not. Um, I will throw out some of the stuff I don't want. I do want, ooh, I do want the string, though. Though I could toss the seeds. Seeds are easy enough to come by, especially right now with all of this grass around. And while I am waiting and getting more bits of wool from these sheepies, 
I'm also going to check out this lit area, which I think is just a lava pool. Yeah, it's just a lava pool. Hello, Mr. Creeper. You are not what I wanted to see. Yeah, I should probably find a couple more spiders just to uh, be able to make a bow. Ooh, Mr. Ember Enderman. Mr. Enderman, I'm going to kill you. Come on, come on, come over here. Come over here. Aggro you away from all the other guys. There we go. And you give me an ender eye. Perfect. Or an ender pearl. Not ender eye, ender pearl. Which is perfect. Because that is something I will need moving forward to get to the end. Defeat the ender dragon. Uh-huh. I heard you. Also heard the bow shot at me. Where is where's the moon? The moon is setting. Which is perfect. Uh, I could I could throw down a uh was it workbench and uh, make a bed. I do have quite a bit of wool. But I don't want to do that quite yet. Go away, creeper. Go away, creeper. Go away. Okay. Well, the sun is starting to rise a bit. Which is good for me, because I can slowly start heading over there. I just really didn't want to head over there during the night and unleash zombie wrath upon the village. But as the day approaches, the zombies will burn and their wrath will subside for the night. I need to eat some food. Eat it in peace. So I don't get murdered. Okay. Well, there's a zombie. I'll let it approach. I will let it die. There's a creeper. There we go. Let it die. And hold on just a second. Okay. I am back from that. It is now day. Let me feel comfortable enough that I can enter this village without any issue. So there are plenty. There's even rabbits. No, you, you stop it. You leave the testificates alone. You paper for emeralds, books for book and emerald for fire protection three. That's not horrible. But I have a bed. That is amazing. So I have a bed. Do they have a blacksmith? What do you trade? Zombie flesh for emeralds? If I kept zombie flesh. Do you have... I hear... Okay. He died. He was right there. He died. I think that was two houses actually uh, combined together. Um, is this two towns? I think this might be two... Towns. But there is a blacksmith. Ooh. Oh, well, I got some food. I mean, there, there's some free furnaces. I don't have to make my own. Um, bunch of wheat, which is good. Some uh, rabbits, which I will go ahead and murder. Because I'm mad that I did not get my... You're a baby. You get to live for now. There we go. There are quite a few pumpkins, too. So, you're a baby as well. Um, I might look into making some pumpkin pie, because that would be worth it, worthwhile. Paper for emeralds. Uh, zombie flush. Paper, paper. Um, you're all librarians and hunt. I think they're hunters, is the ones asking for zombie flesh. There's not a whole variety of uh, testificates here. Here, you... Nope! Oops! I did not mean to do that. You, can say you seem stuck. Ah, there's the blacksmith. What do you want? Uh, coal. Really? Silk touch shovel. You have bad, bad trades, man. Hmm. 
Yeah, second, second town, not the most exciting of things. That is weird. That is very weird. Um, oh, there's iron down there, but all those mobs. All of those mobs. I'm looking for, like, surface iron, because that would be, that would be fantastic. The one thing that I think I'm going to try and do in this city, unlike the last one, is push everyone into a house. Or a pit, or something, and keep them safe. Because that would be, probably like a pit would be the easiest thing to do. Just shove everyone into a hole in the ground and cover it up and like dig, dig out a spot where... I can get to, like, next to a house, even. So, dig it out like this. Uh, make it so I can get to it easily from inside the house. Is this a house that had... I think it's a house that has a... Yes, it is! Wow, my inventory is completely full. I will eat this apple. I'll eat some rabbit haunches. And uh, make myself a couple sticks. Make myself a shovel. There we go. Replace the shovel that I have broken. And work on being able to protect all the villagers. So, yes. I will do this. Dig it down one more. Because I only need a height of two. Um, and then... Come in this way, and come up this way, and come up here. There we go. So now I have an entrance into uh, this house. Get rid of that. So now what I can do is, for the time being, block off the entrance there, and slowly, if I had an emerald... If I had an emerald, I think I would be able to get an, get them to follow me. Um, you want, what, 22 coal for an emerald. You know, that might be actually feasible to do. Let's just see how many emeralds I can get. What can I throw out? Throw out the seeds. Because I think if you have one emerald, they'll actually follow you around if you hold it out. Which is what I'm going to try and do. And I'm going to try and save as many of them as I possibly can. Um, so getting one emerald, I mean, that's a lot of coal. But at the same time, I can just make charcoal. So even though it takes time to make, unlike coal, which really you just mine. Um, yeah, getting 22 is... Absolutely nothing. In fact, I will get as many as I possibly can out of here. So if I want to cook food and whatnot, and it's getting to be nighttime, so I'm going to quit for now, come up here, get the emerald from the blacksmith. Just have to find him again. Um, where did you go, Mr. Blacksmith? You go into the blacksmith house. No. Where are you? Where are you, Mr. Blacksmith? Because you are my ticket to potentially saving everyone. Save the blacksmith. Save the world. Oh, fudge. I should have I should have just locked him up somewhere. Hello, bunny. What I should have done. Just locked up the blacksmith. Oh, where are you? Where are all these zombies coming from? There's like, they're just kind of wandering out of... Oh, they're coming up from the underground. Okay. I mean, not the... It's not good. It's not horrible, though. Yeah, you're down there. So wander around. Ah, there you are. Okay. 
Let me trade with you. Do that. Get an emerald. Uh, do that. Toss out. Now do you follow me? Because I thought you did. I thought if you had an emerald, they would follow you. Apparently not. Now I just have to remember which house I built my pit behind. So what house did I build my pit behind? I think it was... It was one of the bigger houses. I think it was... This... This one? Actually, I do not remember now. Well, unfortunately, Mr. Testificates... Oh, there it is. There's my pit. Fortunately, testificates, you may die! Because you are not willing to actually participate in, uh... Yeah, you're not willing to participate in things. Anyway, I'm going to end it here for now. Maybe I can save some stuff, save some people next time. But for now, this has been Ninja Boy, and I will be back later with more Nomad Adventures. See you guys then.